Super Doppler 4 HD weather forecast. And the satellite picture of the radar in the southeast. We only had showers and thunderstorms really fire up all around us, except for right on top of us. We have a few showers in our area, and I'll zoom into them on live Super Doppler 4 HD in just a second. These thunderstorms fired up around Orangeburg, and then as they just kind of moved northward, they just fell apart. These showers and thunderstorms actually developed along a sea breeze with this water temperatures in the Atlantic right now are in about the mid 80s. So that doesn't that seems pretty warm, but it almost acts like a mini cold front because it's bumping into air that's in the 90s. So it helps lift the air with all this humidity across the area. And that sea breeze is kind of fired up and kind of weakened somewhat. But it is producing maybe a few showers in the eastern part of the upstate. But for the most part, live Super Doppler 4 HD fairly quiet across the area. And here are these showers that I was talking about a couple lightning strikes in Newberry one lightning strike, and that was really about it. it. Turned into a rain shower, and they're moving quickly off to the north at about 25 to 30 miles per hour. We had a heavy thunder shower, moved over Lake Lanier, over Gainesville in northeastern Georgia, and now it's kind of just fizzling out to just a rain shower just to the east of Dahlonega. All right, our official high today was 91 degrees, a couple of degrees above the average for this time of the year, but humidity levels remaining very high. Missed the all-time record by 9 degrees, 100 degrees set back, not too far back, just in 2007. At the Asheville Regional Airport, we reached 87 degrees this afternoon, 4 degrees above the average and the record high 93 degrees only missed it by six degrees and that was also set back in 2007 not too far back live shot looking over lake hartwell just beautiful just a few clouds out there plenty of sunshine and it is hot it's a good time to be at the lake and be in water if you can because it's 94 degrees at hartwell right now 91 in anderson also in lawrence it's 91 also in downtown greenville mid 80s currently in Asheville. 81 degrees right now in charlotte 94 the hot spot in newberry and in hartwell 81 degrees in Gainesville. Humidity level is not extremely high, but it doesn't take a lot of moisture to make it feel much hotter with the heat index. Feels like 94 in Greenville and in Anderson, 97 the heat index in Lawrence and in Rutherfordton. Upper 90s the heat index in Greenwood, Abbeville, and also in Athens. A little bit of a breeze out there in certain areas, but overall fairly light winds. Heat index of 102 right now in Columbia. Feels like 108 in Hilton Head. That's better than 114 degrees earlier this afternoon. As you can see, going through the evening, just a slight chance of a shower force. This front's going to be a very slow mover. It'll probably stall out just to our west and northwest as we go through the day tomorrow. A little bit better shot at scattered showers with thunderstorms. Tonight, mostly clear to partly cloudy skies in the upstate. Very muggy conditions. A slight chance of that shower thunderstorm in the mountains. Tomorrow, a 30% chance of afternoon, evening showers and thunderstorms in the upstate. A better chance, a 50% chance in the mountains. 40 plus looks like this. We'll drop the temperatures a little bit into the upper 80s instead of 90s, but humidity levels remaining very high because of more clouds and a better chance of thunderstorms.